Imagine stepping into a time machine, your heart racing with joy and excitement as you prepare to witness the greatest moments in history. Think of standing beside the pharaohs as the pyramids rise or exchanging ideas with Leonardo da Vinci. But what if your journey goes horribly wrong, landing you in a prehistoric nightmare? Brace yourself as we dive into the Mesozoic era, an age teeming with colossal predators, lethal environments, and relentless dangers. Discover why you should never, ever travel back 150 million years in time. This may be the absolute worst period, and why surviving even a single day would be a monumental challenge. Before we reveal why the Mesozoic era tops the list, let's set some ground rules. Our criteria include factors like environment, predators, natural disasters, and overall survivability for a modern human. Spoiler alert, Hollywood may have glamorized the age of dinosaurs, but the reality was far more deadly. The Mesozoic era, spanning roughly from 252 to 66 million years ago, is divided into three periods, the Triassic, Jurassic, and Cretaceous. Each of these periods brought its own unique challenges, making the entire era a nightmare for human survival. Let's break down each period to understand why this era is a no-go. The Mesozoic era began during the Triassic period, Following the most catastrophic extinction catastrophe in Earth's history, the Permian-Triassic extinction event, it was a period of recuperation and reconstruction. It would be difficult for humans to find livable areas due to the unpredictable environment, which featured intense heat and arid conditions. The earliest reptiles and dinosaurs started to emerge. These included predators like the Colophysis, who were swift and nimble hunters that could seriously harm an unprotected human. Furthermore, Toxic gases were emitted by the unrelenting volcanic activity, resulting in dangerous habitats that frequently experienced lava flows and eruptions, making survival extremely difficult. Although the Jurassic period is renowned for its majestic scenery and enormous dinosaurs, it was by no means a human utopia. During this time, some of the most terrifying predators, like the enormous Stegosaurus with its powerful tail spikes and the Allosaurus, rose to prominence. These animals ruled the land, and people stood little chance against their ferocious instincts and overwhelming strength. It would be very difficult to locate secure cover in the vast, dense forests and wetlands, since they would be tough to navigate and might easily conceal predators. The majority of the vegetation was made up of gymnosperms, such as conifers and cycads, which meant that there were no edible plants like the ones we have today making it difficult to find sustenance. The final and possibly most hazardous stage of the Mesozoic era, the Cretaceous Epoch, brought with it hitherto unheard of dangers. Coming across a T-Rex would be a death sentence for any human. Large herbivores like Triceratops and enormous sauropods like Argentinosaurus, which may be lethal because to their size and defensive habits, dominated the more diversified environments. Giant marine reptiles like Plesiosaurus and Mosasaurus ruled the oceans, making it exceedingly risky to venture near bodies of water. The size of the insects was much greater. Some species may grow to enormous proportions that would pose serious risks to people. Swarms of these enormous insects could be both a nuisance and a threat. Now that we have discussed the three Mesozoic era periods, let's discuss some more potentially fatal reasons why it would be extremely dangerous for humans to travel back in time to this era. First, let's talk about the environment. The Mesozoic era was characterized by a hot, humid climate with high levels of atmospheric carbon dioxide. There were no ice caps, and sea levels were significantly higher than today, creating vast inland seas. This greenhouse world would be unbearably hot and humid for humans, making it difficult to find a comfortable or safe habitat. The flora of the time consisted mainly of ferns, cicads, and conifers, with flowering plants only appearing later in the Cretaceous. The lush forests dominated the landscape, but the lack of familiar fruit-bearing plants and other modern crops would make foraging for food a significant challenge. Now let's address the giant scaly elephant in the room, dinosaurs. The Mesozoic era is best known as the age of dinosaurs, and these creatures were formidable predators. Imagine encountering a Tyrannosaurus rex one of the most fearsome predators to ever walk the earth. Standing up to 20 feet or 6 meter and 40 feet or 12 meter in length, with bone-crushing jaws and razor-sharp teeth, 
A T-Rex would be an unstoppable threat to any human. Or consider the Velociraptor, a smaller but highly intelligent predator known for its agility and hunting prowess. These pack hunters could easily outsmart and outrun a human, making them incredibly dangerous. Even the herbivorous dinosaurs posed a threat. Take the Triceratops with its massive horns and protective frill, or the towering Brachiosaurus, which despite its plant-based diet, could accidentally crush a human underfoot. Dinosaurs weren't the only predators. The seas were home to monstrous marine reptiles like the Mosasaurus and Plesiosaurus, which could easily swallow a human whole. The skies were dominated by giant pterosaurs like Pteranodon and Quetzalcoatlus, some of which had wingspans of over 30 feet. While primarily fish eaters, their sheer size and predatory nature made them a threat. The Mesozoic was also a time of significant geological activity. Massive volcanic eruptions, such as those in the Deccan Traps towards the end of the Cretaceous, released toxic gases and triggered climate changes. Earthquakes and tsunamis were common, adding another layer of danger. Beyond the immediate dangers of predators and natural disasters, the Mesozoic environment itself was hostile to human life. The high levels of carbon dioxide would make breathing difficult, and the lack of clean water sources would lead to dehydration and disease. There were no modern medicines, and the risk of infection from even a minor injury was high. Furthermore, with no social structures, tools, or shelter, humans would be incredibly vulnerable. The lack of advanced technology and weapons would make it nearly impossible to defend against the many threats. Time travel might be a fascinating concept, but not every era is worth the trip. The Mesozoic era, with its extreme climate, dangerous predators, and constant natural disasters, stands out as the absolute worst period for a human to visit. The sheer number of life-threatening challenges would make survival nearly impossible. What do you think? Would you risk traveling to the age of dinosaurs? Let us know in the comments, and if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Until next time.